What's up, everybody? Uh, I want to start this video apologizing uh, because in a previous video where I take my Mustang to the di to the Dino Jet, uh, you saw me putting a bag of ice on top of the supercharger. Uh, that is not something that you're supposed to do. Uh, <laughs> It's actually really something really stupid. Um, I didn't know at the time. I didn't realize it, at least. Um, and that's why I did it. But you're not supposed to do it uh, because you can mess up, get that supercharger all messed up inside. So don't do it. That's why I'm apologizing right now because I don't want people to do it. As soon as I posted that video on YouTube, I received a message from a guy that most most people know him as Yolo Douchebag. Uh, if you have seen his video, he's really funny, funny guy. He knows a lot about Mustangs. He worked for VMP Performance. My supercharger is VMP, so when uh, when he saw the video, he sent me a message on Messenger, and. This is the, the message, I'm going to read it to you, it's some, something real quick, it says don't put ice on the supercharger, ever, it's a quick way to seize the blower or crack the case, 120 intake air temps are very low, anything over 140 is high, just an FYI. And I said, I tell him, thanks bro, I didn't know that. And he replied in Spanish because we were Puerto Ricans. So he replied, ahora sabes. You know now. Now you know. Whatever. Don't do it. Just don't do it. It was a big mistake. My bad. Now I'm apologizing. Just in case you take that as a reference when you watch that video. Don't do it. Simply don't do it. Now... Uh, let's go and do what I want to show you uh, on this video. Something simple. Okay, so what we're going to be installing today is something real simple. Uh, it's, the, it's from UPR. It's a UPR uh, one-way billet crankcase breather. Uh, something real simple, but it's going to help a lot with the, uh, with the pressure on the, on the crankcase to free some of that up and, and save the engine in the long run. Here's a filter. It's still in the wrapper. And this. Okay, so let's open this. That thing is gonna go right there. It's gonna replace that ugly oil cap. So basically, all you need to do is get these two pieces together, which is this way, the long part. Of course, because this is the the thread for the for the car, for the valve cover. All right, so you just. Place this in here, get this inside, like that, get it tight, and this is how it looks put together on the inside there you're gonna see a like a it's like a filter you can hear it the bearing inside 
looks really cool. It's a little bit fucked up here. Shit. <sighs> yeah. Better. All right. Now, get this thing out. Don't throw it away. You never know when you're gonna need it again. And. Boom, just like that. Really, really clean. It looks great. It's gonna help the catch can a little bit more with the function of, you know, it's gonna be less pressure, so. Uh, the only thing I'll know is if I'm gonna have a lot of oil coming out of, of the filter. That's, that's something I don't know, so. Hopefully not. <laughs> I don't like to have a mess. So yeah, that's, that's it. Um, I post a video later after I do some test, testing with it and see what happens. That's gonna be all for today. Thanks for watching. Uh, like always, subscribe and watch the video. Thanks for watching.